Frustrating, that's how one local health care worker describes watching Medicaid expansion get blocked again. A judge handed the state a win yesterday, ruling the ballot initiative that a majority of Missourians voted for last August was unconstitutional. Medicaid expansion was likely to end up in court after state lawmakers refused to pay for it. Without that funding, the governor pulled expansion altogether. Caught in the political process is roughly 275,000 low-income adults the ones who make too much money to qualify for Mo Health Net and too little for federal health insurance. The head of the Medicaid application process at Northwest Health Services says the entire process has been heartbreaking. To see these families who fall in that gap, it's, um, you know, you cry with them sometimes because you don't, I feel like I, I don't know what to do or how to help them, you, you know, give them a little bit of hope to say, I'll put you on my Medicaid expansion list. And, you know, when, and when it happens, um, I can call you and we can go through that process. Sometimes it's just so frustrating. The three Missourians who sued the state in Cole County and lost say they plan to appeal the decision to the state Supreme Court.